hi it's your star and today I'm back with a product review for gel nail polish that you can buy at the drugstore and I'm going to kind of compare a few brands that I've purchased and what I think about them then I'm going to do a mini haul from Marshall's clearance okay so the first nail polish that I purchased that was gel nail was this Wet n Wild One Step Wonder Gel. And this is new, this is a new product. This was $4.99 and it comes in like this black bottle but the color is um, Crime of Passion. Okay, and that's that red that you saw me with on um, some of my past videos. This nail polish is only one step you don't need to put like a clear coat over it or anything. Um, it lasted longer than I expected to, expected it to, and I, you know, it was still going strong when I took it off. You know, I was like very impressed with this wet model. So, good job. The next one I purchased was by Sinful Colors, and this is it. And this is step one color and it's sinful shine and this is the color royal flush and it also came with a top coat and i don't have that oh, oh here it is these came together so the top coat and the color came in one package and it was 5.99 for the package now the top coat is really shiny and like y'all can see I have it on this nail. It's really shiny and I like it. But the nail color, it came off and it, it chips off very easily. It's not like your typical gel nail and it's not, it doesn't last two weeks. So if you're gonna, um, if you're gonna purchase the sinful gel, don't even, don't even attempt, go for the wet and wild. It's a dollar cheaper, it's one step, and it lasts, okay? Don't even go for this. Uh, it's a pretty color, and like I said, it's a good deal if you just want this top coat. <laughs> it's really shiny. It's a good deal if you just want a nail polish color and a top coat. I would actually use this top coat over other gel nail polishes, just, just saying. But the color chips, so. And then I recently just purchased this one the other day. This is a Sally Henson gel, um, Miracle Gel. And I've heard wonderful things about this gel nail polish. So I'm just like, let me try this. So um, I put it on this finger and it's a really pretty pink. This is in a pink Cadillacer. And it's just like a really pretty pink and I thought it was cute. It has not chipped. I've washed hair. I've done my kids hair. I've done chores all day. I've been out to the mall. Um, it hasn't chipped so we'll see how this one does. I'm thinking since it is Sally Henson it's gonna go for a while. So we'll see. But those that's my review on those two um, for the less price. Less pricier gel nails go for the wet and wild. Okay, and they have many colors. Um, blues, light pinks, reds, purples, and so on. Okay, so moving on to my little mini haul that I got at Marshalls. Marshalls was having a clearance, a red tag clearance. That means they had to get rid of this stuff, so I ran. Um, and it had, most of the stuff I got was not even on clearance. So my daughter wanted these Shopkin leggings because she loves Shopkins and they were just her size. And these were $7.99 and so I picked them up for her. I'm such a good mom. Okay. <laughs> so the next thing I saw that I just had to have y'all was this makeup brush. This is a blush brush by Master of Beauty. And this is in the Rose Gold collection. This was $8.00. And I think it was normally, and I can't even see the price. Let's see if I can peel it off and see the original. I can't. 
was probably like $16. Okay. So this is a rose gold blush brush and I'm trying to improve on my makeup brush collection. And so every time I see, I know I should just get a whole set, right? But every time I see a really nice one, I will pick it up. It's like, they don't all have to match. I'm not, I'm not there, you know, trying to find all the matches, but look at this y'all. Isn't this, and it's soft and it's like a gold handle and yeah, it just feels really nice. Let me see how I'm just gonna, I'm gonna put a pop of color on just to test it out. Um, yeah, I'm gonna use my blush I got off Miss A. Oh, it feels really nice and it blends it so good. It's like, see, it's way better than my other one, that's for sure. And it feels so good, it's like a face massage. Now I see why people spend so much money on high end brushes. I have been missing out. Okay. <laughs> so now that I'm all rougey, I'm gonna I'm gonna enjoy putting on blush now. Okay. So that's what I got. The next thing I picked up were these little tier, like three tier. Um, it's by Enter Design Pocket Oh Packet Organizer. So you can put this in like your cabinet and organize food packets, tea, and all that stuff. But y'all know I'm going to use this for makeup, right? <laughs> Let me show you what I'm going to use it for. My palettes. Bam. And I'm going to put this on my, my vanity. And let's see. Because right now I have them in this giant candle holder or candle bowl thingy. It's just like a big candle ceramic thing and it's big and it's cute but it's not going to hold on my palettes for very long and I just need it to upgrade to something a little better so there you have it I can just reach and grab I can see I don't have to dig and take everything out to look for what I'm looking for I can see what I'm grabbing and this is matching you know my decor in my room this is what I had them in. <laughs> so as you can see, this is a bit more organized and easy to find. So there. And that was only $5.99 um, at Marshalls. So the next thing I picked up were these clear, well, oh man, I don't know if these were broken because they're broken. I don't know if these were broken in the store or my kids did this. But anyway, it's on. It's only the bottom. Bottom is cracked. It was nine ninety nine. This was the last one they had. Um, so it's just a little. But clear. I did find this when I was getting ready to check out. I saw this at the counter, and this was only look how much seven ninety nine. You get Mark Jacobs dot, and this is a um, is this a roller ball or a spray? It's a spray. You get a uh, Marc Jacobs Dot Spray. I'm gonna go ahead and spray some on. It smells so good. You can keep this in your purse. You know, when you travel. This is only $7.99. They had other perfumes up there as well for about the same price. So you can't beat that. Um, they're cheaper than the ones on sale at Sephora. They're cheaper than the ones on sale at um, TJ Maxx. So go to Marshall's. And look for the little um, little spray mm, perfumes near the counter or wherever they have them at at your Marshalls and they should be on sale because they were okay and I think that's all I purchased at Marshalls because I wasn't in there very long we went to the mall at like 5 30 and it closed at 6 <laughs> so we were in and out y'all we were just like surprise trip to the mall we were just in and out but I did pick that up um there is a Marshalls in the mall where I live because I um there's like a huge mall called Katie Mills Mall it's five miles like you can walk and you will be walking forever they have every store in there they have outlet they have Kate Spade outlet they have Michael Kors outlet they have coach outlet like you can get 
all this stuff for like 70% off and <laughs> they have all of this so it's always packed there's always tourists because it's like and it's a really nice mall it's like really really nice they have a movie theater in it they have like um bungee jumping not bungee jumping it's like a bungee thing that they do it's like it's a huge mall. so thank you so much for tuning in to my review on the nail polishes and my little mini haul from marshall's um if y'all have a really good look this one's already messed up if y'all have a really good gel nail polish that works for y'all um or um uh, something like that let me know in the comments uh if this uh, sally henson is really good um it looks like it's gonna be good so i'm excited for that also um like sometimes for my little accent nail i just put a jam berry on there and that does like i like having the little jam berry uh accessory nail i call it and they're like these really cool vinyl nail wraps that stay on forever and um yeah so y'all tell me if y'all know any cool good at home do it yourself no light required gel nail polishes because i really like them they work good they last long i don't have to worry about painting them all the time because they don't chip but i was very disappointed like i said in this sinful shine stuff so thank y'all so much for watching i'll see y'all later bye